Hey, look, we're back. Where we last left off, we had a total TPK. We're starting again, and I want to go over a few things before we continue. First off, I want to remark on look who died again. I have Pray Tell Mox, but that isn't Outrider. That's right, Elena died again. So, the curse continues of I cannot keep Elena alive. Ignore this unit right there. I'm going to delete her soon. I'm just using her as a someone to go on cover it missions with. And this unit's going to be turned into something a little bit later. Yeah, just about all my units are hurt because I just finished a minion, a minion, a mission where I had like just four or five gaggles, just Mouton and Berserkers. Luckily, no one died. Two people got knocked unconscious, but surprisingly enough, no one died. So, beggars can't be choosers. Also, oh wait, no, I didn't want to go there yet. Uh, alien, I'll do that later. Uh, what else, what else, what else? By the way, is the mic working properly? Yes, it is. getting closer to hunting us down every day. The only way we can stop them is to strike first. And we'll need to work on a covert action with the resistance in order to do that. With my foreign hurt units, right? The ring. Yeah, no. The factions have readied proposals for various covert missions. We should head to the ring to plan our next stop. You get that infirmary for 115 supplies. Uh, but in my guerrilla tactics... I now have both squad upgrades, so I can have a max size of six, and the specialist cool under pressure, so I can crit and do higher aim when doing my um, overwatch shots, which is good, and reaction shots in general. Okay, but that's where we are. We just finished the mission, which means we have a little bit of time for the next one. We're finishing the psionics lab. We're a little bit low on income, because we're, oh, and I doubled the avatar time thing, because, I, again, I don't hate myself. Can I finish this? Oh, I can finish this time for the supply drop, too. To get extra amounts of income. If your newfound understanding nice. brings us closer to a decisive ending, then I welcome your attempts to find me. Yeah, yeah, whatever. I, I could have predicted this outcome, so it is intriguing. Instant. Grenade. Ooh, an advanced grenade launcher and plasma grenade. Plasma grenade is just a more damaging grenade for obvious reasons. Instant. Mimic beacon. And more importantly, this breakthrough. It costs an additional research station upgrade in our laboratory. Sure. On the bright side, none of my main friends have died yet, so no, I'm still on one of everybody. So, that's neat. I haven't even died either. The only person that's really died so far is um, Outrider, which is a shame. The sexual tension between her and Mox was just so good. Finish off this. That's higher income now when the supply drop happens in two days. Income. Let's do those alloys and crystals. I'm only going to get 117, but money's money. Hey, I outdid myself. Nice. Also, notice how the hunter hasn't spawned yet, so that's also another good thing. And I got one placement here, so that means I can place a thing here, and another placement here. I'm going to do it so psionic attacks on my units cause damage back to the caster. And that's it for right now. Yes, investigate that now. And he got healed back up. I'm going to make sure I have enough units to do this. So before I send out someone on a covert ac action, I need to make sure I have eight units. Okay, I did. Which means I can afford to do this now. Promotion, that'll be good. Aim, wouldn't be bad. Bonds, meh. Hacking, though. Dodge. Honestly, when it comes to these things, I tend to look more so for the upgrades that we get. Do I have two specialists ready? I don't have either specialist ready. Never mind, then. We're not doing that. Hacking. Let's reduce the avatar project just so I can get a promotion. On to me, I guess. And let's send out Andy to go with me. Stop the catcher. Get going, you two. We will begin the covert action immediately, Commander. Thank you. Now, excuse me while I get these supplies. 
Oh, God damn it. Uh. Oh, hell no. No, no, no. Nope, that's fine. Commander, yep, skip mission. That's, information. that's fine. I'm not doing a three man mission. Screw that noise. Yeah, I know I just finished building that. I don't care. I'm not doing a three man mission. Bite me. I earned my six man. I'm not doing a three man. Is that enough to get a psionic lab? No, I need a little more supplies. Which I can get from the black market. By selling some intel. Uh, where are you, black market? Ah, here you are. Avenger plotting new course. The black market recuperates every single month and it'll have new sub uh, stuff for you to get. Good. I'm here for supplies, please. Yes. I'll hold on some rest of my intel because I need to start getting my map all the way filled out. Local resistance forces in this region have gone into hiding after the recent setback, Commander. We'll have to wait for them to regroup before we can try to make contact again. Worth. Commander, we currently have no new supplies coming in. We'll need to seek out new means of replenishing our resources. Check initiated. Uh, let's put a gremlin in here. So, the remember I was talking about how the workshop worked? So now the workshop is making it so that there are gremlins in, or more or less, engineers. There's extra engineers that I can put in these rooms to get my free, just engineers. I have an empty room here. Infirmary, that's probably what I put in here, right? Where you put the infirmary in here? Yeah, I put the infirmary here. I don't need the alien alloys. Let's just go back to making contact with everything. 50, 97. Course for West Asia. Notice how on the top right I'm getting no income because I don't have enough other, I don't have enough resistance groups up, especially since I just lost one. This will prove to have been an important Thank you. Commander. With the advent officer currently in cold storage, no. we should perform the autopsy as soon as possible. Uh, we can wait on that. Spectre. Wait, you didn't see that one yet? Gosh, I shouldn't have skipped over that. It just talks about how he's, these things are just tiny little robots, more or less. And now that I have time to do the, not have to do with the Avatar project every single time, the game's far more fun. It's letting me build up my forces and get going. Yeah, 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 whatever. So, how's everyone doing out there? I'm doing just fine. A covert action. Boop. How many do I lose? One or two? Ooh, two. Good job, guys. There were some casualties during that last covert action, Commander. But our troops will all recover after some well-earned rest. What? Casualties? What? Wait, what? I've got a no, there weren't. The, aliens. the invasion was one thing. All their advanced technology. They had the drop on us. There was no casualties, or just casualty means just any damage at all. We could never hmm. for, even with better gear. Between the propaganda, the handouts, and the seemingly endless supply of <sighs> and peacekeepers, they are nothing but trouble for an upstart resistance. Death from above. So what death from above does? If I'm on a higher elevation and I get my kill with a shot. I don't end up. I don't end my turn, which means I can get my shot, reload, get my shot, reload, which makes uh, the snipers even better. Snipers are really all about late game scaling. You know how like ADCs and League of Legends are like all about late game. Same concept. They start off kind of meh to weak, and then as you get late game, you're able to instantly get around the map and stuff like that. Their power skyrockets. How many units do I have currently able to fight? One, two, three, four, five, six. Enough. Finish off the Scilab in a couple days. Resistance ring. Let's get going with the resistance ring. Aim wouldn't be bad. Hacking would be better. Dodge. Meh. Hacking again. What's my highest hacking right now? Four, five. Yeah, let's go get that five hacking. Do I have... You'll be ready to heal. You'll be up by then. Soldier. Put in this random squatty. Intel up. What does that do? 
Oh yeah, let's get rid of the damage. And I have two days before my other specialist is ready? That's fine. There we go. These findings will likely prove crucial to our ongoing efforts. Retraction fields. Using material covered from the remains of the alien specter. Retraction field technology will equip Oh, cool. So I can like triple in certain missions I could triple invis myself. Neat. Berserker. You also have the Berserker gives me the overdrive serum. So what's happening in the video game industry? You know what's happening that makes me sad? There's Atlas. Atlas is bending the knee, more or less. So for those who don't know what that means, bending the knee is when a company or corporation kind of cows to the demands of... Commander, with the number lost. Of we've lost? Sure. We'll get an engineer here, or a scientist? I'll take the engineer. Unfortunately, we only have the resources but yeah, bending the knee more or less says that you're just kind of adhering to whatever a subsection of people are complaining about. And sometimes it's, it's, it works and it's a good thing. Case in point, technically... Oh, shut up. Technically, they bent the knee when it came to people complaining about the Sonic movie. And that turned out good, though. But in this case, there is a subset forums called the Reset Era, which are known to be kind of... I'm not sure if it's called alt-left or alt-right, but they have some very hard opinions on things. And their opinions tend not to mean a lot because they also are under the... They have a mindset of protecting, like, pedophiles and stuff, so, like, who the fuck cares about their opinion? And they're complaining about Persona 5 Royal, or Persona 5 in general, because there's a scene where Ryuji, the male, like, counterpart character to your Joker, is getting harassed by gay males. They're predators, more or less. And they're like, oh my god, you can't portray, you can't portray gay males like that. And I kind of, I kind of, if they were just on it, now, if there was, like, no other cases of people being predatory, and it was just, they just kind of added that to add that, I'd understand that. And I kind of understand them complaining about, oh, we were just using this to, um, bash gays or stuff like that. But the problem is, their argument is, why are you okay with doing this? And then utterly ignore how Kamoshida does, is just as much of a predator and far more, more worse than a human being in the very first chapter of the game. Which tells me that they either... A are okay with like this kind of predation as long as it's not in a subculture they agree with, or B they didn't play the game anyway, weren't gonna buy the game anyway, which means even more reason they shouldn't even waste their time commenting on or even like paying attention to these people. So it's fine, the game's still gonna be fine. I like that one scene of Ryuji being harassed by the, those two sexual and feminine males isn't gonna like hurt the spectacle of the game, and that's only in the American version that happens, but. I just wish t sometimes corporations would stop listening to people who weren't going to support and or buy their game anyway, you know? Okay, so we now have a full party of six, which makes missions a decent bit easier. Now all I need is my next set of weapon upgrades and my last set of my last two sets of units, and I will be utterly tapped out for what I want my team to be, you know. Is it just loss or is it lost in something else? Menace one five. The communications relay is up ahead. Move in and destroy the target. As I expected, Commander, there are significant readings indicative of the lost moving throughout the combat zone. Be careful out there. Will do, buddy. Aye, aye. <laughs> uh, Ethan also has a different name this time around. He is the Cobra. I guess we can just move you to here. Solid copy. <laughs> God, it's so bad, but it fits... This friend of mine, Ethan, is this monotone. So it, it's it's fine. It's fine. Open this door. There's the lost, which means I can book it to here. Got it. Move it. Oh, hi. Thought that was a loss for a second there. Got another group over here. That'll alert. 
So will that. That won't. I'll go quickly. Okay. I can get you to here. I can get you to here. No need to have twice. And my oh, uh here we go. I'll be swift. You cannot run. We got Oh, snap. Cleaned up the design, but these monsters are no better than the ones my father dealt with. We got a new unit type already. I was not expecting that. Good thing I sent my outrider up first to investigate. Why aren't the lost attacking them? Honestly, I forgot the name of these enemies. I will go. They're like uh, aviators or something like that. Archons. There we go. Archons. I knew it started with an A. Got it covered. Got more lost here, which are for some reason not attacking, even though it literally says how they constantly attack anything that moves. But it's fine. It's totally fine. Moving far. Move you here. Beat, beat. And wait. There we go. And here. Tell you gotta be careful to click while someone's running because then it'll like shift your mouse clicker down. And here. I am trusting you. You will never hide from me. I can see the objective from here. Okay, we got two mutons. We have a positive ID on the alien relay. Several lost. There we go. There we go. Now they're starting to aggro in on each other. Took them long enough. Don't come outside. Don't come outside. Uh, stop moving. You are really close to me. Literally, had they had he moved up even one more step, he would have saw me. I really like how small the notification zone is for Reapers. It's really useful for using them as scouts, you know? Nice. Okay. So what we're going to do is get our Reaper out of there. Moving as ordered. And then moving our Reaper in... Oh, wait, no. Here we go. Moving our Reaper inside the building. I guess everyone else is just really hunkered down, honestly. Or better yet, let's get behind this object right here. Yeah. Confirmed. Yeah, let's just get everyone out of dodge. Hunker down. Oh, we got the lost over there, so we should start moving towards here as well. A good decision. Here. Here. And wait. There we go. Here. Heading to that location. I got several turns. Let's let let I'm gonna let them infight first to do as much damage to each other before I get into actual combat myself. So, did everyone have a nice day? Mine's was okay. I, funnily enough, I took like a three hour nap. It was just, I don't know why, but today was just really long. So after martial arts today, after teaching the karate today, I was just like, I can't do tutoring or anything. I had to call off. And we had these really awesome gamer chairs that my instructor bought because he was like, huh, these things are better than office chairs, cheaper and more comfortable. I guess I'll just use these. So... I literally took a nap in one. He actually came in and was like, hey, what you doing? I'm taking a nap, sir. I'm tired. Oh, okay. Here, let me let me show you that you can actually pull out the lower part of the seat and you can get even more comfortable. My sensei is such a great guy. I do not know what I would do without him. Known him for like 20 years of my life. Ooh, look who's all crowding around there. This would be a really good time to remote start. Oh, this would be an amazing time to remote start. N move a little closer. 
Oh, yes, 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 yes. Oh, more? Okay. I wonder if I can, like... Don't look at me. Ooh. Darn it! Oh, I made the right play. Darn it. Ah. If I would moved them even more to the left, I, I possibly could have let cheese this even harder. Oh, well. Who's still concealed? Oh, well. Yeah, you were concealed. Alright, that's fine, I suppose. That's just begging to be remote started, though, so. How much damage can you do with your remote start? And can you hit everybody? No. Darn. That's fine. This can, though. So, we're gonna move you to here? Or here? This should be enough. And it should also keep me hidden. We're gonna put a shrapnel down right here. It requires patience. How do you not see someone like chucking a thing that spark? Stop asking questions, me. Just stop asking questions. Yeah, you should be able to kill this guy. Oh, you literally can't fail to kill this guy. 100% chance, 3 damage minimum. Ninety-seven, eighty-seven, eighty-seven. What's my chance to hit the Archon? Seventy-two. We'll take the seventy-two percent. Nice. Ah, grazed him. Still decent chunk of damage. You be in that battle frenzy. Okay, okay, okay. So here's my game plan. I'm gonna move here. I'm going to grapple up to the higher. No, not on top of the truck. There we go. We're gonna grapple up to here. And then finally, we're gonna summon a lot of loss for this. But come on. Oh, it's a little too short. Darn it. If only I had a grenader. feel kind of odd putting you out in the open like this, especially when I'm how much I say you should always have someone in cover, but this is just too good of an opportunity not to take. Where is the Claymore exactly? It is right under that Mouton's feet. Stop moving the camera. Yeah. This should kill literally all of them between the grenade and the Claymore going off. Didn't quite kill. Okay, 1 HP, 1 HP, 5 HP. Close enough. Uh, summons a Lost Swarm, but I think it was worth it for how much damage I just did there. Oh, wait, maybe... Oh, no. Uh-oh. That's a lot more than I expected. That's a lot more than I expected, and or wanted for that matter. Can I hit any of you without being set on fire? Doesn't seem like it. 5 HP left. Maybe you can kill with your higher height advantage. 86, 86, 71. Sure, we'll take the 71 for a free attack. Oh, yeah, Whiplash is just a free attack. Shouldn't have missed, but whatever. And it doesn't cost an action. See, can I grenade them down now? Why am I lagging? And why do you keep snapping? Stop it. If I wanted to throw it over there, I'd throw it over there. Oh my god, that's not good. 90. Okay. 85. 85. I got 
nothing. I'm running low on ammo. Is that my last person with a turn? Seems like it. I can't throw a grenade that far. You're out in the open. Yeah, I have to do this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to run up and try to kill this Archon. And with my special ability, I should be able to either run away or do a different option, depending on if everything goes well here. Oh, God. Get my focus up. You already know what focus does. Oh, okay, so I can't do it. I have a new ability on on my Templars, which says if I want to, I can just hold still. I'm pretty sure you might have already seen Perry, but I can hold still and not do anything and get a free attack or get a free no damage. They're moving to the side. Please don't hit me. Thank you. They're targeting me. Please don't hit me. I would be mad. I would be so mad. Where are you guys going? Where are you guys going? Weird. So the reason that these guys are over there are staying in an orange little cone is because I got the ability that says if a reaper sees them, they stay lit up for the rest of the fight. There's the other gaggle of freaking lost. God, my game is chugging. I think I might need to restart my PC. Oh, we're already here though, so we're just going to deal with it. Take your sweet old time over there, why don't you? You are still running. Did you just split into two people? Ow. Oh, you got baby tapped. Quit whining. Okay. 100%. Chance to... Eh, I'm not digging that. Let's move you to here. Got it. That's much better. Shit. Yeah. See? More reliable. There's a chance that he couldn't have, he might have not killed, so we're just going to take the insured stuff. This isn't going to kill, unless I crit. But it's going to do a decent chunk of damage, which is worth it. Okay. Could use some ammo. 95, sure. I mean, you missed an 85, so maybe I shouldn't have said sure. Reload. Honestly, though, Sarah's been putting in a lot of work for my team, so I can't even complain all that much. Nice. 77? Good. And finally... Let's just move you all the way out of the way of this combat. I go where I'm needed. Oh, shit. Um... Mm. I need to get you away from here. So let's move you outside again. Falk says I am to obey. The target is marked. 59. 67? Yeah, we'll take 67. It's fine. I, I, wanted, I wanted the rend anyway. Give me my full focused amount. Uh, God, every single missed shot in this game hurts so much. Like, so goddamn much. It feels like the game is, like, personally slapping you in the face. That's how much it hurts. Are you guys going to get into combat now, or just... No? Okay. Oh, hi. Oh, that's not good. Why, hello there. We're boys, right? You're not going to slap me, right? We're, we don't want to hurt me. I mean, come on. We're like totally the similar species or whatever. Hi. Don't hurt me. Ow. Gross. I can't take this for long. 
You'll be fine. See? Let's shoot this one first. Okay, I see. Like, if I had shot the other one first, it wouldn't have killed. Ninety-nine. This'll kill. I thought he missed for a second there. I would have thought he missed for a second there, and I, and I probably would have ended the episode right here and there. Ah, there it is. That's fine though, since I had three actions this turn because of one of the abilities I got for this guy that says, "Hey, if you've taken damage this turn, enjoy, enjoy your extra action, fair and balanced." Can't do concealment while they can see me. Sure thing. Seventy-seven. Nice. That's right. Weapons burning ammo got it covered. A hundred percent, ninety nine percent. Seventy two percent chance. We'll take it. I shouldn't have took it. Of course not. I keep saying, oh, I'll take it this time. It should be able to hit this. Oh, okay. Every single goddamn time. I don't like putting you in front of an exploding canister, but it should give you a clear line of sight on, yeah, this guy. The potential to kill. Remember how I was talking about how shotgun gets really broken later on in the game? Yeah. I'm just going to hunker down. I don't need to risk... You were, in fact, you want to know how my Elena died? I... My opponent shot me through a wall, getting a critical, because after I revealed myself, uh, after shooting somebody. So it only was like, you know how it's a 50-50 chance for me to reveal or not? The chances of me being revealed, though, it got to like 51%. It barely got past that line part. So it was just a very unfortunate situation, and, and I would be lying if I said I wasn't very, very upset at what happened. We're also going to conceal you, so you don't risk getting aggro. Wait, won't you still get aggro anyway? Because you're going to move towards me? Yeah. Actually, no, it's good, because now you're not going to aggro on Ethan. On the margins. You might see him, but at least you won't aggro on him. Parried. Oh, that wasn't even a parry. That was just a raw deflect. So I have another ability with them that says if you there's a chance you get shot, you might just utterly ignore it. So that's really good. They know I'm here now. That's that's fine. You you didn't draw aggro from this advent guy, so we'll take it. Okay. I have three turns left to get that alien transmission. I might have to start moving in there towards there. Yeah, let's start going in there with Ethan to go cut it up. I should have enough units to do enough damage to this thing elsewhere, though. Reload. Turbo. Who has a better shot? You have a 97% chance with a decent chance to crit. Sure. No crits. Decent damage, though. Well, that reveal is the real question. Mm, yup. Darn. No more options here. Rain down bullets? Sure. Pray tell Mox is still alive. Not sure how much longer, but at least he's still alive. 59%. Not liking those odds. Let's just come over here and cut him up. This world is ours. Slice. Parry. There's no reason for you to move, so let's just parry. 81. I think Sarah might have my highest KDA at the moment. On and you can long watch shoot this thing. You got it, Drew. I believe in you. Alright, you really can't miss things that don't move. 
I can't kill you because you how much life you have, so. I might be able to kill you here and with another attack, maybe? Nah, shot high. You can't do damage to him. If I kill you here and now, does that stop the next horde from spawning? Nice crit. Nope, we're still gonna get one more horde spawning, so let's just move everyone all together. Reload. Good to go. Reload. Re -up and reload. Shadow. I strike from the darkness. Overwatch. Or suddenly long watch. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let me use the correct grammar. No, not hunker down. Overwatch. Uh let's have you hunker down though. And have you go into Overwatch. Alright, where's the last swarm at? Come over here. Yo, does that loss have like 10 HP? Oh god, that's a lot of them. That's an obscene amount of them, in fact. Oh, I forgot about the loot! Wait, wait, don't... How many turns has it been on the battlefield? I utterly forgot about it. I was too focused on actually finishing the mission. Please don't blow up. I actually want to pick you up. Darn it! No! Ah. That's a shame. Solid cut. Bang, bang, bang. Oh. Yeah, I was right. You do have 10 HP. It's ridiculous, man. On my way. I'm on it. Fifty percent chance to reveal me. I failed the first time. How about the second time? Fail again. We are known to them. Reload. Long watch. Overwatch and Overwatch and Overwatch. Can you kill him, Sarah? Nope. How about you, Drew? Yep. Oh, no. Nice. Oh, she's about to be swarmed. Wait. Wait, 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 you don't have you don't need to do this. Come on, you don't need to do this, guys. We're friends here. We're bros. Oh. <laughs> they don't do a lot of damage, but still. 84. I wonder what the highest damage ever done in this game is. Probably some ridiculous amount and you scaling a one unit stupidly high. I think the highest I've ever done is 30 something with a crit from my sniper. Boop. Boop. He didn't miss. He didn't miss. Just the game lagging a little bit. 82. Good. Wait, why do I have two different reload animations? I have the whole cool guy single cock, single cock with one hand reload, and then I have the more practical reloading with two hands because... Reloading a shotgun with one hand is actually incredibly hard. Oh, and the reason that I did one damage, even though I missed, is because I put an add-on onto Ethan's gun that says I will do at least one damage if I miss. Which isn't terrible. I'll probably get a different upgrade later, but for right now, it was just free. And since I have the option to, to switch and change my upgrades and mods as I please, there's no downside to it. Yeah, yeah, I see that. You will never hide from me. Am I almost done yet? Give me a minute. 
Reload. How many more of you guys are there? Is it just you? Please be just you. There we go, I'm done, finally. How many units did I kill? It has to be at least 50 plus, right? Status confirmed. All hostiles are down and the area is secure. Status confirmed. Mission 37. My god. I mean, sure, most of them were mindless zombies that took no effort to kill, but... Still. Ugh. Ugh. Come on, chop chop. And despite the destruction left in their wake, XCOM refuses to let go of the ways of the old world. I wonder why. They continue their wanton and reckless crimes until the entire world burns around them. We are grateful to the elders for their support in ending this menace once and for all. Your propaganda is so annoying. And it does make me question that if we had a case like this in real life, would we be listening to it this d discreetly? But then again, all I, I know the first time we meet aliens is going to be a question of, Can you fuck it? Yeah, what? No, these are aliens. Why would our DNAs work together? Can you fuck it? No. Aww. The moment we meet aliens, I know for a fact, it, that's going to be our first question. Not how can we intermingle as a species to improve ourselves, not what we can provide for each other. No, it's going to be a question of, can you fuck it? Oh, hey, cool. By improving our understanding of how the lost have come to overrun the cities of the old world, it's likely you can develop a means of avoiding or perhaps manipulating their movements. Neat. New engineer. We're getting thin on manpower, Commander. We should check with Resistance HQ for new recruits. Put the engineer here. That'll be fine. I need to hurry up and get that Psy Lab, though. So I can start getting my Psy units. Don't need a scientist. I need to finish this radio relay. I need more income. Carry on. Don't care. You don't want to start fighting those guys early, trust me. 14 ability points. Good. Let's see. Aim. Not bad. Hacking. Good. Dodge. Whatever. Supplies. Good. Increase income, not bad, and health. Uh, I care more about hacking, honestly. Let's have Sarah get this one. Then we'll put you to go help. Add an engineer, the one in the power relay. Ambush high. Hmm. Nah, I don't, I don't feel like taking a high ambush chance. It's not worth it. That's better. Zara and you. I'll order my people to get underway immediately. I have enough people ready, in just in case we have to rush into a combat again. But I should have enough time to finish this radio relay. I have made a number nice. Of interesting Overdrive serum, whatever. I don't care. Improvement to bullpups, that I do care about. Go ahead, raise the avatar project. Now that I actually have a decent amount of time, rather than it happening in like two minutes, I feel better about it raising up. I don't feel like this is cheating when the main combat, the difficulty is supposed to be the combat. Ah, she's learning more and more about me, that's not good. I might actually have to start cutting her down. There we go, Psy Lab. Our soldiers can now begin training as Psy operatives. So you know those psionic abilities that the uh, sectoids have? Now you can have them. These units are stupid. Anyone who says otherwise is actually wrong. Put the gremlin in here. Uh, oh, I don't have the supplies for it right now, that sucks. Maybe I have the supplies for it. Mm, where are you? Black market. Avenger plotting new course. What can I sell to get the supplies? Do I have enough intel? Probably not. Buy. Did I already buy your supplies for the month? Yes, I did. Sell inventory. I honestly don't care about this data cache. 
I don't care about this data, data pad either. How many lost bodies do I have? I probably have a lot. I can't say the lost bodies. Darn it. Take my goddamn zombies. I don't want them. They're stinking up the place. Whatever. Sell the flashbang. That's enough. That's still horrifying. I want to be able to have two people in here at all times, so... Commander, we currently have no new supplies coming in. Recruit. We'll need to seek out new means of replenishing you. our resources. Upgrade. And now I can have two people training at all times. So you. And you. Now there's one more set of units that I want, and I will be fully happy with my roster. But that's DLC that will eventually pop up when it feels like popping up. Oh god, I'm literally losing money now. Yee. Yeah. Okay, now I'm only losing 32. Yay! How long will this take? Five to seven days? Let's go. Will that literally take money away from me? Or, hey, what's going to happen there? Whatever, don't care. I suppose since that worked, we might as well keep it up, Commander. Must have been our lucky day. Everyone's getting sloppy. Aim. Hacking. Dodge. The health. I care about that aim. And I especially care for it on my sharpshooters. Let's put it on me again, because I'm biased. Get out there. How many units do I have ready? 11? Good. I'm staff engineer. What? Who's not staffed? Commander. Our ring facility is currently idle. If we have the soldiers to spare, we should deploy them on a covert action. Didn't I resistance. literally just put you on a covert action? Would I? Understood, Commander. Did my followers. What? <laughs> I could have swore I just did that. Oh, I do have an unstaff engineer. Let's put you in here. Okay. We're now in a better spot than we were last time. A miles better spot than we were last time. And all it took was me getting double the time to do the Avatar projects. Commander, the aliens are still moving forward on the mm -hmm. Avatar project. Taking out that facility would deal a serious blow to their efforts. Is there a mod that reduces to how much they talk? Because I understand the concept of them needing to talk, but I hate that they chime in on literally everything. We should perform the autopsy the product of an extensive fusion of both alien biological material and advanced mechanical support systems. The Archon is an unusually ornate design by alien standards. With an air of authority spurred by its distinctive appearance, I can only assume the aliens intended it to be something of a herald. To the other forces. Is this man digging into alien bodies without gloves on? I saw his open hand for a little bit. That has to be so unsanitary. What's wrong with you, man? Who knows? What happens if their blood's acidic? You could get hurt. A. So now these guys are going to start getting abilities of of all the other psionic abilities, uh, psionic people that you saw. Psionics could be considered the alien's greatest strength. Can tap into that same power. Once you get all of their abilities on them, these units get absolutely broken. And you just train them up to get all their abilities. Uh, let's get insanity. And continue training. Soul fire! It's also far easier to train them up than other units as well. Our action together is complete, Commander. If it means increasing, let's get 
Adam and who are you bonded with Adam Erica oh you're wounded in that case let's get Sarah in here instead so that you can increase your bond level Sarah and who is bonded with Seth get your bond level up no reason to get wounded if I can pay the resources for it You do that, as I continue to get some money. Priority message coming through, Commander. Putting it on screen now. It is unfortunate, Commander. Bite me. That your recent efforts have proven to be so mediocre. All has been revealed. I hope you will prepare a warm welcome for my arrival. Risk of capture on all covert actions. That's not good. How many supplies do I have? Not a lot. Hey, I found the hunter. Contact with in this region warned us that one of the chosen has been terrorizing the area for some time now. Here's the intel they've collected so far. And just where do you think you're going? Nowhere at the moment. Right now, I'm just trying to build up money. You better bring everything you've got. Do I have enough money to? Yes, I do. Sweet. Double pill. That's pretty good. What are our options? Alien loot, trial by fire, covert actions, and resistance orders. I don't need more engineers at the moment. Don't need more scientists. Don't need to fabricate PC PCSs. Hmm. I guess, though, getting you higher faction influence isn't a bad idea, though. Let's increase the health of my Grenader. And prevent capture by sending in me. Or no. Let's send in... Scorch. Low chance of ambush, low chance of damage. Seven days. Get going, guys. Go find out where she is so I can kill her and be done with her. So I can fight the two easier chosen. An engineer. Alright, I don't... Again, I said I didn't need an extra engineer, but we'll take an engineer if you want to give it to me. Ugh. 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 I don't want to get cocky. I'm, I'm in a better position than I was last time, but I do not want to get cocky. I also don't want to take these guys quite yet. Do I? Nah, not yet. I'm going to let you get a few more abilities before I start taking you guys on missions. Skirmisher. Oh, come on, video game. You're, this is a very fun game, but this it's so poorly optimized. Uh, sharpshooter and grenader. Everyone good? Seems like it. Onward. I wonder if the the Reapers are hunched over because they eat alien meat. Could have phrased that a little bit better. Could have phrased that a little bit better. One moment. I need to check one thing. Alright. Be begin the mission. Why? <laughs> this game is so poorly optimized. I love it. It's a fun game. It's an amazing game, but it's so poorly optimized. Don't don't crash, please. Please? I'm doing it's doing a little whole spinny ball thing for your mouse right now. You can see in the bottom right that the it symbol isn't symbol. The symbol isn't moving. The emblem isn't moving. Please don't crash on me. Please. Okay, thank God. You need to get a new PC one of these days. I think I've said that as well too. There's no rush. This thing can probably hold out for another probably two years or three. If I'm being generous. Oh, 
hopefully when it comes to Switch, this game will be far more optimized so that you don't have to deal with wait times like this. Will do. Video game, please. Come on, you can do this. I believe in you. Stop chugging. <laughs> Just appear on top of the building. We have a confirmed location for the VIP. Move to rendezvous. Eliminate all hostile contacts. Is that man naked? What am I saying? Like the Dalai Lama over here? Goodbye. I will go. That's kind of close. On the move. You go here. Feet, feet. You go here. Moving far. You go here. Affirmative. I can put you on the open. Time to motor. And finally. Oh no, that was left on a person. Confirmed. Yo, Claus, if you can get information on like literally any of the other units, that'd be great. Can I even get down this building without? Yeah, I can. I, I. How are you guys that blind? How do you not see like a military man or a military person without having any gear on? Just whatever. It's fine. It's fine. That causes noise. This doesn't. As you order. Here. Hey Sarah, is your hack decent enough to actually get this off without triggering anything? I don't know how evil this game would be if it was like, oh, you used your hack. That cost a turn. Nah, not high enough to. And I really don't care about stun, especially when I don't see anybody. Showtime? That's my name? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Whatever, it's fine, it's fine. Rolling. Keep rolling, 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 rolling. The fact that Max's name is Kong is kind of funny because he's... No, I wouldn't say like a huge fan of King Kong, but he, he likes King Kong like more than Godzilla. The aliens move among us. Okay, so you're over there. So this mech, notice how it's red instead of uh, white, and it has three pieces of armor? Yeah. These other people in the way, though, is making this hard. Why the hell are you people here? Got it. Oh, I can't quite reach there. I can get to here, though. 
can't get there. Let's get you to here instead. I have a chance at all of you. We're not going to shoot yet. Covering. Why'd you shout that? Don't be dumb. Good enough. Can I toss a claymore all the way over there, though? Yes, I can. Alright, let's start this up. Mox, if you could move, that'd be great. So let's move you to here. As you command. Move our grenade up. There's no way you can probably get a grenade all the way over here, could you? No. With the upgrade, I eventually I'm eventually gonna get for a uh, grenade. He would be able to, but not with the current one we have. But this should be good enough now. Yep. I think it's gonna kill everyone except for the red boy. Between the shrapnel and the grenade, that's like 11 damage minimum. Yep, see? Oh, look at you wide out in the open. Bang. Where's everybody else? Wait, why? I would have been so mad if that triggered other enemies. Why would you just run into this highly classified area? What sense does that make? The shadows save us. Who saw me? Roger that. At least Ethan's still concealed. Sure thing. We're gonna start moving you over here. Cause sadly we are forced to get distraction over there. Even though that's not how drop ships actually work, isn't the point it's supposed to be that they're incredibly flexible? Whatever. I'm not mad. You're mad. Please be Hunter. Oh, thank God. So many choices. Can solve savage allies, reveals concealed units, gains health when enemy nearby enemies take damage. Takes additional enemies from three attacks in a single turn, and weak to Templars. Sure. So little time. You're not a threat. Stop acting like you are. You are miles easier than your sister. Let's be honest, she would kick your ass in a fight. We'll have to deal with it before it throws off the rest of our operation. Menace one five, be advised. Hostile interceptors are inbound on your current position. Firebrand has a limited window to provide extraction. Wait, what? We've got the VIP in tow, moving to evac. Menace one five status confirmed. Why is he naked? Proceed to the extraction point. Oh, no, there, there we go. He's just sitting next to a naked butt. What? Got it. I am the yeah, go back into shadow, please. Oh, right. Oh, that was a waste. That was really dumb. Hmm. Eh, it's fine. It's fine. Not really in all that bad of a position at the moment. Because it's Hunter. Now if it had been um Assassin, that'd be really bad for me. But eh. I just wasted an ability though. So there's literally nothing Ethan can do against this guy. I wanna put you behind the sign. To not risk triggering out any other enemies. Why are you people still here? Leave! Don't climb on top of the building, you morons! You idiots are too stupid to live. Yeah, you're gonna lose your concealment, so screw it. Just run to here, Ethan. Double time. Wait, what? Why didn't you lose your concealment? 
Strange. And I guess Overwatch, not that it really matters. Who are in the way? Where is he? No, seriously, like, where the fuck is he? And where are the enemies? Maybe I shouldn't complain about that. It's just kind of weird, you know? I guess we'll just move everybody up. Oh, wait, was that him? Oh, they're on top of the roof. Then these haven't triggered. That's fine. Don't trigger. I'll just leave. I'm totally okay with them staying right on the roof and not triggering. Don't oh, come. Come. Okay. Sure. Sure, why not? Ugh, I should have figured going out in the middle like that would trigger these guys. Ugh. So they're not going to get a chance to attack, but the ones on the roof will. Please just don't shoot my VIP. Your turns, you pieces of shit. The target is marked. Yeah, of course you're gonna take him. No. No. <laughs> what is that voice? You cannot run. I should be able to get the VIP out of here though. And if you're stupid enough to just sit right next to a car... Hmm. Just panicked. Panic's not mind controls. Oh wait, that might be bad for you. Ooh, good resist, good resist, good resist. He has a problem where other people panic, he panics. And because of that thing where I said if you use psionic abilities on me, you take damage, eat that feedback loop. Why not shoot at the sectoid? Eh, whatever. I know where Hi. We are. The legendary XCOM and their noble commander continue their valiant struggle against overwhelming odds. A minor hiccup in the Elder's plans. One I must remedy shortly. You wish. The elders hunter. From what we've heard, he's a relentless tracker with an unnatural ability to call his shots. He's literally like a hunter from uh, uh oh. She fails me. Ow. Is that it? It's pathetic. But yeah, he's literally just a hunter from like uh what's it called? Too easy on me. I won't. But my VIP is out of here now. Goodbye. Oh wait. Oh, wait, did I just fuck up? I forgot about you. Okay, no, you're fine. That was the, the, the actually the smart play then. Because now, no one else is gonna get Overwatch shot. Let's get you to here. Remote start here. No, this car. No, th this car, please. Thank you. That should instantly kill this guy. Oh, come on. Hmm.
Ethan can't go yet because of the thing. 86, 80, 80, 71, 66, 58. Darn it. Let's put you here. On my way. And grenade you. Just to get you. Why are you snapping? Just to get you out of here so that Ethan can get his turns back. Because remember, when these guys die, the Shadow Clone dies. Of course you had loot. I'm going to come up there and cut your ass. Now, which sectoid's causing pa Oh, this sectoid. The sectoid that has damage. That's the one that's causing panic. No. Oh, I'm at a bad angle. I thought he was I thought he was on the side here. No, 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 no. Here we go. Excuse me, pardon me. Slash. X ray neutralized. You are a cold blooded killer, Commander. It takes one to know one. Who else has a turn? Is it just my sniper and Max left? Yep. 81% chance to crit and kill? We'll take it. Close. I hope it's worth it. It should be worth it. Yeah, you're dead. Bang. So I have the Hunter, I have a Sectoid, and I have the Advent Trooper guy. Oh, hi. That was a pathetic crit. Oh, I forgot you were here. Uh-oh. Ow. Never mind, I also forgot this other advent person who was here. You're telling me. Uh-oh. Oh, no. That's on Ethan. Whatever. I'm honestly not that in that bad of a spot, because I can use this to just heal up Ethan. I can probably just dash you out of here, honestly. Uh, yeah. Let's just get our sniper out of here. Get you out of dodge. Advent Trooper. Yeah, let's grapple you up to here. Since you're at full life, you can afford to take some damage and some hits. Like I said, once the game goes on, you have some actual gear and stuff. The game, the game's difficulty scales down just a tiny bit because you can take more than one shot as opposed to oh. I took one shot, I guess I'm just dead now, whereas my enemies can take multiple shots. Seventy-seven there. Seventy-one there. I should be able to kill this advent guy if I move to here with Max. I'm on it. Load him up. Armor shredded. Which is what I really wanted. I just want the armor shredded so then Ethan can... Honestly, Ethan, I need you to shotgun this guy down. Just just put your shotgun right in his face and blow his head off. Thank you. Ninety-two percent, yeah. Don't have a shot on him yet, so Overwatch. Uh oh. So we haven't seen this alien yet. 
This guy can put a congealing poison in you, and then if they're chrysalids. And after you are injected with their poison, if you if that unit dies, they become a hive to summon more chrysalids. Trank shot, what? Oh, that's literally just Ana's move from, well, I guess, to, no, this game came out after Overwatch. No, it came out before Overwatch. Wait, no, this DLC came out after Overwatch. Did Ana come out in 2017 or 2018, though? Hmm. But yeah, that's literally just Ana's move from Overwatch. Neat. Neat. Can anyone even get in range to undaze him? I guess you can. Wait, does that cost? Yeah, that costs two. So let's move you to here, actually. I go as ordered. Later. Yo, Ethan, up and at him. We do not need you getting captured. Chip chop, stand up. Good. 39%, no. Better yet, Sarah, just just spend your turn healing everybody, or healing the people who need it, like me, and then Max. Okay, you did some cover, and make him easier to be shot at, po possibly hitting him as well. Okay. I bet you can't do that again. Sure, I can watch. Rude. 54 because you're behind full cover. 81. Did you guys hear that? I have no idea. I just heard some like talking in out of my radio or something. That was odd. Can I do this without hitting? Let's see if I can just blow up your cover then. I want to be able to hit both this pillar, him, and this wall right here, but I can't do it without also hitting me. Fifty-four percent still. You, that almost killed you. That did kill you. What do you mean? Might as well start throwing rocks. You're dead. <laughs> How you gonna talk that much shit to get your ass kicked? What? Not bad, Commander. It's time for a tactical retreat. But it's we'll it's astounding how much easier you are than your sister. But there's no trace of that chosen left. I've got a feeling we haven't seen the last of them. Still, at least we ruined their plans today. Affirmative, covering nine. And turn. Let's try to take out this last chrysalid guy before getting onto our ship. Damn. Yeah, I didn't get it. Damn. I can only play myself. Ha! You missed. You don't even get to do your attack. Reload. Gun him down. More so just wanted the hollow targeting, which should make it easier for everyone else to kill you. If up oh, oh. Game froze for a second there. And now we're free to leave without any repercussions. God, I don't understand why. I wish their the difficulties of the three chosen were scaled out better. Because I've said it once, I said it again. There is no reason why the assassin should be just that much harder of a fight compared to the other two. Or if it is, make her the last one. When I eventually the first time I beat the assassin and got rid of her permanently, I was thinking, all right. I guess the other two chosen are going to be just as difficult. No, they're utter fucking cakewalks compared to 
um, what's it called, compared to the assassin, compared to Shadow Maiden. The fact that she just bolts after getting her hit and just flipping around the entire map. But, no, then you have the the hunter guy and the next guy you'll see. It's, it's utter cakewalks. It's actually embarrassing how much easier they are. But it's fine. It's fine. Uh, there we go, though. Ugh. I would have never found out what dissident actually meant if not for the outer worlds. A small bump on the path of salvation the elders have set forth for us. Took a lot of damage that round, but no one went into bleeding out, no one died, so whatever. The hunter kind of threw off my plans for a little bit. That's what made that maybe even start taking damage. Why the hell were they on the roof? I should have figured they were on the roof, though. When targeting by enemy fire, far back. Hmm, not bad. All these are really good. Shoot. Shoot. No. These are all really good. No. Damn it. Oh, hey. So now you get the momentum thing that that uh, Templars have, but you have to kill a unit. Let's go impeccable. Or placeable. Low on scientists, whatever. Develop and deploy advanced new technologies. Any recruits you encounter with a proclivity towards the sciences would be of great use to me. Boo the bond at the, the training center. Soldiers continues to grow. They yes. can gain additional tactical strengths if they continue their training together. Seems pretty good bonds. I should have probably read out what those were instead of just looking at them. <laughs> Hindsight. This will prove to be an important step forward. It's fusion blade, fusion ripjack. Now my melee attackers so of my temple, uh, not my templar, sure my um skirmisher and my ranger will do more damage with their melee attacks. This is literally just a high frequency blade from Metal Gear Vengeance, by the way, and you can't tell me otherwise. The lost Although autopsy. similar in appearance to the psionic zombies we have encountered previously in our engagements with the aliens, all current indications are that these lost are the product of something else entirely. Prolonged exposure to the chemical agents first released in the earliest stages of the invasion seem to have turned these once innocent civilians into yet another form of the undead. Why are his eyes still glowing? My guy, why are you doing this without putting gloves on your hands? Continue training. Soul fire. Continue training. Fuse. So, uh, soul fire is just like an instant, automatic, always gonna land, can't be blocked attack, even if you're behind a wall. And Fuse says, oh, you have an explosive in your pocket? Well, I'm gonna use it to blow you up. Which is as dumb as you think it is. I think they actually nerf Psy operatives by making their time take more to actually get them new abilities, which, it, which is fair. Ultrasonic lore. What we learned of the Lost and their behaviors, the Ultrasonic lore was designed to help control their movement in the field. Deployed like a grenade, the lore will draw the Lost to wherever the th device is thrown. Any lice within sight of the target area will move to attack. Ah, fine, we'll do it. Officers appear to be similar, if not physically the same as the common Advent Trooper in terms of power and agility. However, field reports indicate a more developed mental acuity, 
as the officers do provide tactical directives to the subordinate advent forces. Hence why they're able to mark you and make you easier to hit and do more damage. I take it this was easier than your last procedure, Doctor. Central, Commander. Yes, I find the process to be far less disconcerting when the subject has already expired. The results, however, it's best you see for yourself. My autopsy of the Advent Captain has confirmed the existence of an implant, similar in design to the unit I extracted from the Commander. But there are differences. What kind of differences? The data you see is being pulled directly from this Advent Captain's implant. The sequence here is essentially you, Commander. Or at least the tactical information they were processing through your mind. As you can see, the data is nearly identical. They were using you against us. Yep. Yes. However, the Advent data shows signs of decay. Removing the Commander from their network has likely caused significant damage. Network? Yes. What we're seeing here is a psionic network. These implants are capable of receiving and transmitting information, a great deal of information, somehow encoded in a stream of psionic energy. My working theory? Advent uses this network to augment the tactical readiness of its troops, as well as disseminate orders from its central command. Observe. subjects diminished condition the implant continues to have an effect that's horrifying doc achievement or a weakness potentially but i need direct access to their network to know for sure i'm guessing that won't be easy we never is active link and that would mean hacking a live advent officer like i said not easy still it's the best lead we've got your call, Commander. I.E. we're literally going to... Yeah, we're going to make this spike and call the Skulljack and literally grind our... a spike into their brain to get the information we need. Hooray for ultraviolence. Ooh, proving grounds. The Advent Captain seems to provide a means of stabilizing the link. The Advent... Arc Blade and Ion Ripper. So this is the partway upgrade as well. This so there's like level two and level three upgrade. The fusion blade is level three. This is the level two. Mech. A gremlin upgrades. Blue screen protocol. I can make EMPs now. Turret breakdown. Defense matrix. I can now put down defense towers for when you'll see later. Purifier. Reinforced underlay increases the health of my utility items. Alirium research, that's what I really care about. Live fire training. So, once you have an entire region under your, with a resistance, you get these bonuses. You know how, like, in risk. Yeah, he's not wrong. But yeah, you know how in Risk you, you may have all of a region you get buffs? Same concepts. Any user, unit training in the GTS will achieve the rank of Sergeant. You have achieved that bonus. So, yeah. Um, Let's start heading for Indonesia. For the Indonesian zone. I'm going to end the episode soon, but I want to wait until the next mission pops. soldiers we sent to the training center have developed an even stronger bond if we continue to send them out together in the field their effectiveness will only grow commander the aliens shut up i understand go away give me back access to the game please continue training let's give you soul steel soul steel transfers half the damage done to cyprotip as hp so each time i do damage i get to life steal and that's not, I think that's also for, not to, isn't just my sonic abilities, that's also my guns. Sweet. Some additional intel on the Chosen as a result of our latest action. 
Sweet. Keep this up, Commander, and we might just make you an honorary Reaper. Thank you. Something new for us, Commander. My Reapers are up for taking on some additional orders. Experimental ammo projects in the Proving Grounds are automatically completed. Nah, I don't care about that right now. I care about getting supplies. Our influence with the Resistance factions has motivated them to share some new information on the Chosen. So to get the last part of being able to find the Chosen, I need to have a major. So, aka I have time. Aim, dodge, dodge, health, ability power, health, mobility, hacking, care about that, promotion, promotion. Let's get those promotions. Yeah, we'll get a new resistance order. Level up you. Using a Reaper to go do a Templar mission. There's some real irony there if I've ever seen it. Ambush medium chance. Mm, sure. My followers will lead this action to victory. Unstaffed engineer. Well, I don't have anywhere to put him. There we go. Alright, and with that, I think it's a pretty decent place to stop. We're now in a far better place than we were in the last part. We're actually making some advancements because we're not worried about the Avatar project. We don't have to rush and do missions we're not ready for. That being said, we're going to keep going next time. For everyone out there watching, thank you. I want you to have a good morning, evening, day, or night, wherever you're at. But for right now, wait. Yeah, but for right now, I'm out. Later.